Love is true, love is kind. Love it waits when you're out of time. It won't fail. It Welcome won't to your Boho Beautiful Pilates Workout Blast. Today is going to be a quick and super effective 10 minute Pilates workout that is going to focus on toning and strengthening your obliques and lower and upper abdominals to give you a true 360 core workout. Through using different toning Pilates exercises, this class is going to get your muscles fired up to boost your metabolism and truly get you to that next level of muscle strength and definition. So if you're ready to get started, Grab your mat and let's begin. All right, friends, we're going to get started today standing at the back of your mat. So go ahead and come into a standing position with your feet together. We're going to begin by first finding our center within the body. Taking a deep breath in, and I want you to reach both arms up to the sky. On your exhale, you're going to dive your arms and body down, so dive it like you're diving into the water. Walk your hands forward into plank position. Find your center. Pull the navel into the spine. On your exhale, you're going to walk your hands back towards the feet. And then slowly roll back up to standing. Let's do that again. Let's inhale, reach both arms up to the sky. Exhale, roll and dive it down. Walk forward into plank. Find your center, pull the navel into the spine, shoulders above your wrist. And then as you exhale, walk back towards your feet. Roll it up to standing. Two more times, adding on to our plank position now. Let's take an inhale, reach both arms up. Exhale, dive it down, roll it down. Walk into plank position. Now once you're in your plank, you're going to shift your weight forward and shift it back one, two, shift and back three, and four, and five. Try to keep a straight back. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Walk your hands back over to your feet. Slowly roll yourself up to standing. And let's do that one more time. Big breath in. Exhale, dive it down. Walk your hands towards the front of your mat. Plank position. Reach it forward with your body slightly, and then you're gonna pulse it back. Four, one, and two. Reach and back, three, and four. So I come up a little bit higher, my tippy toes, and then I push the heels back. Seven, and eight, nine, the last one. Awesome, hold your plank. Now simply bend your knees and I want you to hop forward towards the front of your mat and land in your seated position. Feet come to the front of your mat. Let's reach both arms forward. And then as you exhale, I want you to bring your heels closer to your body. Grab your ankles, round the spine, roll like a ball. Come on up. So now we're holding at the front of the ankles. Flex your feet to make sure you don't touch the floor as you come on up. And up. Rolling like a ball, keep that spine nice and rounded, and hold. Roll like a ball, engage your core and hold. Roll like a ball, come on up and hold. Don't touch the floor with your feet. Roll back and hold, great job. From here, point the toes, come on up into your boat posture, feet a little bit higher lifted, arms reaching forward, and slowly take it down, three, two, one, left knee to the chest, single leg switches. Let's go for one and two. Inhale, one, two, exhale, three, four, and switch. Switch, keep going. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, keep going. One, two, three, four. Pull that knee to the chest. Three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. Three, four, pull, 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 almost done, pull, pull, one, two, and bring both knees in, great job, extend both legs out, opening into Pilates stand, so heels touching, toes apart, 
From here, your hands are going to come behind your head, elbows out to the side, hold the navel into the spine, lower the legs, and come back up for one. Now lower, and two. The trickiness here of this exercise is to not allow the back to arch as the legs lower. So keep pulling the navel into the spine. It's okay to have a little bit of space between your back and the floor. However, if you're noticing an increased arch as the legs lower, that means you need to not lower the legs too far down. So lowering the legs as far to the point you feel your core unable to hold you anymore. So lower, exhale, bring it up. Inhale, lower, exhale up and release the head. Going into our 100s, if you need to start easy, bend your knees. Otherwise, we're gonna start with our legs together, except halfway through, we're gonna open the legs from one side to the other. So come forward, let's inhale, one, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, 20. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, 30. Inhale, two, three, four, Five, exhale, two, three. Now open the legs. Two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three. Bring the legs together. Two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, other leg. Two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four. Legs together. Two, three, four, five. Exhale, two. Open the legs again. Two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four. Legs together. Two, three, four. Five, exhale, two, three, four, open the other leg, two, three, four, five, exhale, two, three, four, five, legs together, and bend your knees, awesome job. That was a little bit of a twist for your 100s. All right, let's release the head now. Double leg stretch, arms over your head, around into a little ball. Inhale, legs extend, arms out to the side and over your head, exhale, bring it in for one. Inhale out and two. Inhale and three. Inhale and four. Now you can extend your arms to the side and then bring them in, or you can take them all the way up to your ears and around. And in. Same thing, make sure that your back does not arch. Keep pulling the navel into the spine. If you need to extend the legs a little bit higher, that's totally fine. And in. Inhale, extend. Exhale, roll it in. And then grab the back of the knees, roll yourself up to seated. Wonderful job. Let's just stretch it out, look up towards the sky. Exhale, round up through the spine, bring your elbows down, knees to the chest. Next exercise is called the can-can. You're gonna bring your knees to one side and then the other side. So just do that again. Side and side and side. Now adding an extension of the knees, bring it in side side take the knees to the other side extend and in so we go twist and twist twist to the right extend the knees bring it in twist the knees to one side other side side extend bring it in so we're working the obliques here targeting the waistline really fine toning that entire midsection of your body to the side to the side, bring your knees to the left, extend the legs, bring them in. And just take the knees to the side, and the side, bring it back to center, extend the legs up to the sky, corkscrew, go ahead and big circle with the legs and around for one, stay on your elbows. If you need to come all the way down with your back, that's totally fine for two. Big circle and around for three, circle, and four, one more to the right, Stopping at the center, reverse the circle. And five, and around. Four, see how big you can make the circle with your legs. Three, and two, and one. Beautiful, come back to center. Bend your knees, roll yourself all the way down towards your back, hands behind your head, elbows out to the side. From here, we're gonna roll over to one side, bring your knees together, feet up to the sky, clam, you're gonna open up, bring it in. Open the knee and in, open and in. So we're just giving our abdominals a little bit of a break while we target your glute muscle here. 
toning and strengthening your lower body open and in this is also great exercise to strengthen your hips open and in open in try to keep your feet up towards the sky so your toes are connected your heels are apart and the top knee opens and closes open close open close you're almost done and last one awesome from here keep your knees together and then go ahead and just extend that top leg your top arm comes to the floor and then from here you can extend that bottom arm as well drop your legs and lift for one lift for two and three and four and five you can keep your feet slightly forward and your hips slightly back so you can find a little bit more of a balance here in the hip but make sure both legs are lifting up so you're engaging your obliques lift and hold just the top leg up and down up and down lift and lower lift the bottom foot stays off the ground keep lifting up together up together feel free to support your head if you wish or keep it all the way down and now forward and back with your legs forward and back forward and back forward and back so like you're running on the spot forward and back forward back forward back forward back keep going moving your legs keeping your core strong little tiny movements run 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 and together awesome slowly from here go ahead and just switch to the other side so you're going to come over to your side resting your body on your mat go ahead and bend your knees and then just simply open the knee and down so your feet are staying connected they're off the mat your knees come together and open and open and open close and open so targeting the other side now working your other glutes strengthening your other hip see if you can keep your toes connected but the heels do not have to touch open close open close keep going open close open close open almost done open and close try to keep your upper body still great from here just open up those knees take a deep breath in close the knees extend that top leg and then extend the bottom leg so both feet are off the ground lower them and lift them up again lower and lift lower and lift lower and lift so this exercise requires your obliques to really fire up so targeting and toning that entire waistline lift and lower lift and lower almost done and lift both feet off the ground hold it there just the top leg lifts and lowers top and three and four lift and lower lift and lower six and seven and eight nine and ten from here forward and back with your feet forward back forward back forward back so still your legs are off the mat and you're simply just moving them forward and back let it go keep going running on the spot run 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 forward back forward back and legs together awesome job all right let's release yourself over to your belly and let's just come up into our final stretch here into our cobra pose come on up into your elbows feel free to make fists with your hands here just to keep your upper body strong pressing into the elbows elongating the neck stretch out your belly keep looking up towards the sky lengthening through the front body take a deep breath in exhale let it go great job you guys come on all the way down with your body press the hands next to the side push yourself up to your knees and come on up to seated awesome let's just release into our child's pose to release the spine in the opposite direction take one more deep breath in and then exhale come on up to seated reaching both arms up to the sky and then exhale to your heart thank you so much for joining me today for our quick pilates workout blast you did an amazing job and i look forward to seeing you again namaste thanks so much for watching if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up 
And don't forget to click that subscribe button to make sure you stay up to date on all of our new Pilates and yoga classes. Thanks again, and we'll see you soon.